get ready for the dictation start the apex court has occasion to discuss the object behind examination of the accused under section 313 of the code of criminal procedure the apex court held out that failure on the part of the court not to confront the accused with all adverse situation goes to the root of the case and vitiates the entire trial reference in this connection may be made to the judgment of the apex court in the case of sukhjit singh versus state of punjab 2014 10 scc 270 paras 11 to 14 are relevant which are quoted below in this context we may profitably refer to a four judge bench decision in tara singh versus the state AIR 1951 SC 441 where in justice bose explaining the significance of the faithful and fair compliance of section 342 of the code as it stood then opined thus i cannot stress too strongly the importance of observing faithfully and fairly the provisions of section 342 of the criminal procedure code It is not a proper compliance to read out a long string of questions and answers made in the committal court and ask whether the statement is correct. A question of that kind is misleading. It may mean either that the questioner wants to know whether the recording is correct or whether the answers given are true or whether there is some mistake or misunderstanding. despite the accurate recording in the next place it is not sufficient compliance to string together a long series of facts and ask the accused what he has to say about them he must be questioned separately about each material circumstance which is intended to be used against him The whole object of the section is to afford the accused a fair and proper opportunity of explaining circumstances which appear against him. The questioning must therefore be fair and must be couched in a form which an ignorant or illiterate person will be able to appreciate and understand. Even when an accused person is not illiterate, his mind is apt to be perturbed. when he is facing a charge of murder he is therefore in no fit position to understand the significance of a complex question fairness therefore requires that each material circumstance should be put simply and separately in a way that an illiterate mind or one which is perturbed or confused can readily appreciate and understand I do not suggest that every error or omission in this behalf would necessarily vitiate a trial because I am of opinion that errors of this type fail within the category of curable irregularities. Therefore, the question in each case depends upon the degree of the error and upon whether prejudice has been occasioned or is likely to have been occasioned. in my opinion the disregard of the provisions of section 342 of the criminal procedure code is so gross in this case that i feel there is grave likelihood of prejudice in heath singh bhagat singh versus state of madhya bharat air 1953 sc 468 justice bose is speaking for a three judge bench highlighting the importance of recording of the statement of the accused under the code expressed thus now the statements of an accused person recorded under sections 208 209 and 342 criminal pc are among the most important matters to be considered at the trial it has to be remembered that in this country an accused person is not allowed to enter the box and speak on oath in his own defense this may operate for the protection of the accused 
इज सम केसेज बट एक्सपीरियंस एल्स वेयर हैज सोन दैट इट कैन ऑल्सो बी अ पावरफुल एंड इम्प्रेसिव वेपन ऑफ डिफेंस इन द हैंड्स ऑफ एन इनोसेंट मैन द स्टेटमेंट्स ऑफ द एक्यूज रिकॉर्डेड बाय द कॉमिटिंग मजिस्ट्रेट एंड द सेशंस जज आर इंटेंडेड इन इंडिया टू टेक द प्लेस ऑफ वॉट इन इंग्लैंड एंड इन अमेरिका ही वुड बी फ्री टू स्टेट इन हिज ओन वे इन द विटनेस बॉक्स स्टॉप